all you Gator Pinners out there, and uh, welcome back to Haters Gonna Hate. Today we have a very special edition for you. We're going to call it Lovers Gonna Love. Now, with all the love out there that you guys are constantly giving us on a daily basis, it was so hard to narrow it down who I was going to throw in here, who I wasn't. So I wanted to get a little bit of everything, a couple long ones, a couple short ones, a couple medium ones. Let's start off with a couple of short ones. Uh, we'll start right off the rip with Levi Goulet. Uh, he says, 8 out of 8 would fuck which I'd have to say thank you. I appreciate that. Um, I don't know if you have any videos out there or not. I'd have to see them to make a judgment on whether or not I'd fuck back. Uh, a few prerequisites. Uh, you have to be uh, at least 18 years old, preferably my wife. That, I mean, I think she would probably want that as well. And uh, other than that, you'd probably pay me a lot of money. I'm a bit of a man whore. Uh, next up, hey, Nuant. He says, Woo! More Poon Gator! So, uh, <laughs> hate to be the bearer of bad news, but we're, we're Gator, we're Gator Poon. I don't know who this Poon Gator is. Uh, sounds like they're trying to rip off our name a little bit. Uh, but either way, thanks for the love. We appreciate it. The next one here comes from Sam Wall. He says, I laughed at this. Not at the content, but how retarded you are. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. Kind of what we're going for. Uh, so the fact that you enjoyed that got a good laugh out of it and it made your day and probably your week uh, That Touches me right here touches me right here Samuel right here And for that Thank you and you're welcome Next up we have strike eagle. He says I fucking love gator poon. Keep doing what you're doing. First off, uh, Strike Eagle, you need to you need to slow your roll. Uh, nobody, and I I mean nobody, tells me what to do. Just throwing that out there. But other than that, I fucking love you too, buddy. Well, the next one here comes from Michael Craig, and uh, it's a bit of a long one, so let's uh, get through this. Uh, what if this whole thing, the shitty trying too hard to be funny videos, the fifty dollar T shirt Kickstarter. And this response video is all improv, and Gator Poon is just so good at what they're doing that they look like fucking idiots to people that just don't understand their top notch. High quality improv comedy. What if Gator Poon is the next Andy Kaufman? Nah. Diamondcraft says, I don't understand why everyone hates this masterpiece. It must be because they are jealous of Gator Poon and their improv skills. I mean, that's what I've been saying all along. If you don't love it, you don't get it. You don't understand. You don't know what's going on. You don't realize the genius that is going into each and every one of these videos. Every time you think something's bad, that was very, very, very calculated. I put a lot of time and effort in all this stuff, uh, you know. So, yeah, thank you, Diamond Crafts. Thank you for getting it. A lot of these people are just a bunch of dumb dumbs. Worryman Worryman says, I love Great Thorpoon. Come on, hate me for that. I fear you not. Which I love that. <laughs> he knows that liking Gator Poon is like, uh, it's like taboo at this point. It's like, oh, whoa, you're not supposed to like Gator Poon. If you do, you must be fucked up in the head. Well, you know what I have to say to that? Yeah, they're, they're probably right. Probably are fucked up in the head. Sorry, Worryman, but uh, welcome to the club. Most of us Gator Pooners out there, well, we're all fucked up in the head. Thanks for the love, though. We love you, too. Gator Squad. <laughs> Hack your stuff. Loaded myself into the password, snuck in like, like Metal Gear Solid, and I hacked your shit. I'm back. He tried, your corporate ass tried so hard to keep me off these videos. Well, guess what? For the time being, um, for this video, I'm back. <laughs> hmm. Wow. Just uh, looking in your guys' eyes and and how happy everybody is. It's, it's been a while. Hey, Poon Nation! Far, far, far too long. Wow. Um, 
Yeah, I've had a couple questions. Not a lot of answers about my whereabouts. Um, I'll give you guys the skinny. That's what us kids call information. Write it down. I've been working on this uh, riverboat gambling. Uh, a riverboat that's used for gambling. Uh, we've been sailing around uh, Louisiana, Cuba. Don't tell anybody. Um, just, just around, just uh, uh, being a blackjack dealer. Um, I have a couple different tasks with them. Um, I, I do that. I'm an enforcer, and by enforcer, I look up uh, The Sopranos, the TV show on HBO, and I post clips on YouTube. So if you guys ever see that on YouTube, uh, clips of The Sopranos, uh, that's me posting that stuff, just for the gambling boat. What else? What else have I been up to? I have watched the entire series of baseball on Netflix by Ken Burns. I'm pretty much on a constant loop. I I would say I watched it um, 12 times. It's a long series. <laughs> it keeps on going. It, it's all about baseball. It's, I wouldn't I, I wouldn't watch it if I were you. I've been doing that. Um, and besides that, just on the old gambling boat traveling the nation. What have you guys been doing? Uh, give me, uh, put it in the YouTube comment. Uh, what's, what are your plans for the winter? You know, don't put winter's coming. We, we all expect that, okay? Don't, don't be one of those people. Just, uh, if you have vacations, where are you going on vacation? Where, what, 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 what's going on with you? Uh, yeah, make it brief, because I, I don't want to read a freaking book. Good, goodbye. Uh, I'll see you guys uh, 30 more videos from now. Alright, right, this next guy, his name's uh, Josh King. Now, this guy's left a lot of comments. And I'm going to read through a few of them here, and then I'm going to make a couple statements. Uh, first one up, he says, Please sub to channel or leave a comment on my vid. Thanks. Heart. Sorry for asking for so much. Can you please leave a shout out on my channel or a link of my video in the description? Thanks. You're awesome, mate. Then old Josh King says, Hey Gator, just wondering, can you please leave a shout out for me? It would make my day. Oh, and he doesn't stop there. He says, Hey, why didn't you put my YouTube channel video in? Well, first off, the video that you did had nothing to do with Gator Poon whatsoever, and it was a Gator Poon fan-made video contest, so I'm not sure why that would be in there. Uh, the last one here, Gator, please, just do a shout-out. I have my orientation day tomorrow for going into high school, and it would mean the world. <laughs> oh, Josh King. Listen, buddy, it doesn't matter how many times or how many different ways you ask me. I'm never giving you a shout-out. You understand? I'm not going to, like... Post a link to your YouTube channel, like right here, so people can click it. No, I'm not doing that. I'm never, ever, ever giving Josh King a shout out. Not happening, Josh King. Ever. Hypnosis says, great video. I love the funny improv. Thank you very much. Uh, yeah, I put a lot of time and effort into improv. Um, it's not like I just make it up on the spot, you know. The one thing I've learned about improv is you got to script it. That's, uh, that's what people keep telling me. You want to do improv, you need a script. So thank you guys so much for stopping by to this very special edition of Haters Gonna Hate, Lovers Gonna Love. I had a lot of fun. Uh, you know, positive energy, positive flows of positivity and everything. It really, I don't know, really makes me feel better. Makes me feel better about what I'm doing. And it encourages me to continue doing it. So all, you, <laughs> all the haters out there are not going to like that. But you guys keep loving and as always, I've been Gator, and you've been great. The love on lovers gonna love.